<laughs> oh, hello! You surprised me there! I was just drawing some pictures at my desk. Isn't my desk just the coolest? Would you like to know how to make a doll desk of your own? It's pretty easy, actually. Here's what you need to know. And here's what you'll need to do it yourself. Scissors, a straw, double-sided tape, a ruler, paint, a paintbrush and glue. OK, let's get started. You need to collect some matchstick boxes. We got these from a craft shop, but it's much cheaper and better for the planet if you recycle some old empty ones. The first step is super easy. Just add some double-sided tape to the boxes and peel off the other side. You could use glue if you like, any glue really, hot glue or even PVA. Just make sure to allow time for it to dry. And don't get any on anything else. You don't want to DIY your doll. Now, grab your other matchboxes and stick it to the bottom one. Make sure those sides are lined up nice and square. Repeat this step again and you should have three boxes stuck together. Something like this. Doesn't it look like a set of drawers for a dollhouse? If any are upside down, just slide them out and put them in the correct way again. Easy! Let's make something else. What is this? Ooh, it's a desk tidy! That's so cute! Phew! Anyway, back to the desk. You'll need some cardboard from a box like an old cereal box or shoe box. Bring back your set of drawers we made earlier. Now, start to outline it just like this. Follow closely. Let's speed this up a little. When you've got something that looks like this, draw on some little shapes like this. You can do this bit freehand, it doesn't have to be perfect. If you're finding this a little tough to copy, follow the link in the description below to download a printable pattern. Now, let's use a ruler and pen to make sure the outline is good. something like this, well, then it's time to cut it out. Be very careful using scissors. When you've cut it out and have a shape like this, grab your ruler again. Lean heavily on your pen for these lines. You have to draw three lines like this. These are fold lines. Now it's much easier to fold the cardboard. See? Crease them with your fingers to get a nice fold. Now, grab the double-sided tape and add it to the little pieces, just like this. Do both sides. And stick! Remember, you can use glue if you don't have the tape. Back to our drawers. Drawers need handles, 
So let's add some. Grab a pen and scribble on a point until it makes a hole. An adult can help if you're finding it a bit tough. For my handles, I use butterfly pins. You could get them at most craft shops. Just push them through the hole and fasten. If you like, you can just glue some buttons to the front for a simpler solution. Oh, but this does look cute. Okay, next we add some tape to the top and one side of the drawers. As before, it's okay to use glue. Stick the drawers into the desk we folded earlier. Oh, this is my favourite part, painting! I chose green because it is one of my favourite colours. Maybe you can paint yours another colour to match your dollhouse. Oh my gosh, isn't it just the coolest? I can't believe I made this. Have fun making yours. Why don't you comment below to let us know what you'd like me to show you how to make next time. A DIY chair to match your DIY doll desk or a super cute teepee tent. Bye!